Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Visual Tail Beading and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to make these beautiful earrings. They're really easy to make and I will show you step by step so I'm sure by the end of this video you will be able to make them. They are made only out of seed beads and these are 3mm bicons but if you don't have bicons you could use 3mm round beads. Uh, you could use uh, Czech crystals or you could use Forovsky, whatever brand you like. So now, if you like what I'm showing you here, it's a good idea to subscribe if you still haven't and hit that bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh beading ideas. And if you want to support me, uh, you could also like, share and comment. And you don't know how much you help me only with this action and I'll answer to all of your questions in the comments. And you could also check my new merch store where you could find t-shirts, hoodies, pillows, mugs, phone covers and so many other stuff and the designs are made especially from me for you and they are a great present for yourself or for your beading friends and they make you express your personality better and when you buy stuff from there you support me, my channel and my mission and you could find links down there in description and here at the eye icon. But let me stop talking and start with the list of the materials. Okay guys, so what I'm using for this video are two colors of 11 ohm seed beads and I'm using here bicons and uh, ear wires, use any type you like. Here I use monofilament that is 0 0.006 inches or 0 0.15 millimeters. You could use other beading thread of your choice and uh, here I use size 10 beading needle and I'm using my pliers to squeeze my monofilament to go through size 10 beading needle but if you use regular beading thread uh, you won't need the pliers uh, because they are made flat and easily go through size 10 beading needle so these are not obligatory and of course I'm using scissors. Okay now I'm going to take about half an arm span of thread on my needle and I'll be back. Okay, and now I have my thread on my needle and I'm going to take 18 of these beautiful black seed beads. Okay, I have my 18. And now I'm going to slide them down. I will stick my needle in my mat and I'm going to make a knot here. I will go twice through the loop I've made and I'm pulling. Okay, like that. Then I will go through nine beads. Here I'm going through four. Then here through three, and I should go through two more. Now, guys, I need to take one seed bead. Here it is, and I will go here through the following nine beads again. Okay, and I'm taking one more seed bead and I'm going again through all of those beads in this direction. And you see how here I'm forming something like an angle. And I'm going through this angle bead and through the following C bit, just like that. Then what I need are two more silver beads and I'm going back in circle through this black one and if you can go through the following black. So when I pull I have this. Take one more silver Go through this silver and if you can in one movement through the next two black beads. Okay. And I will repeat this one more silver. 
go back through the silver and through the following two black beads. And here I'm adding my last bead from this side. Okay. Just like that. And I'm pulling. Now I will repeat the same thing from the other side. First I'm going through this. So this is the angle bead and my first step is to go through the following black bead. Okay. And then I'm going to take two silvers and I'm going back through this bead. Back in circle and through the following black. So I'm basically repeating what I had from the other side, okay? Then again I'm taking one silver and I'm going back through this black and through the following. Okay. One more silver. And I will continue when I'm up to here. I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next. Okay guys, and now I continue this off camera and I was doing the same thing. So you could pause this video, do this and when you're up to here, meet me to show you what's coming up next. Okay? And I'm adding my last seed bead here. Okay? Like that. Then what I want to do is go through this black one at the angle, again through it. And then go through this silver in that direction. Then I will take just one silver and I will go back in this direction through this silver. You see what I have? Then I'm going through the following silver in this direction. Okay, taking just one seed bead and going to the center of my work. Okay, then go back in this direction. Now it's really easy what I do here. I'm just adding one bead and going to the center and to the outside. It's really easy and pleasant. Okay. Okay, then here through this silver to the outside. Take just one silver, go here to the center, like that. Again to the outside, and I will continue this until uh, up until here.
Okay, now I have this. And what I want to do is go again through this black one. Then through this silver. And I want to exit out of my outside row. Okay, and I will take one bicon going through the following seed bead then one more bicon go here and I will continue this until the end of this row Oh, it looks so cool. I think you could leave it like that if you want and make an earring or a bracelet out of it. But now I think I will do some more steps here. And I will start by taking one silver bead. And as I'm exiting from this silver here, I will go back through it. Okay, like that. Then I will go through the bicon and through the following silver. And I'm going to add one more silver back in circle. You see what I have here? Then I'm going through the following bicon and the following silver taking just one silver and I'm going back here through this silver one okay and I'm going to continue this the same way and when I'm up to here I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next Okay guys, and here I am, where I'm adding my last silver bead from this row. And what I want to do is go here in my following row, through this silver one. And I will take four silver beads. And I'm going through this following silver. By the way, you could do this with 3 millimeter round beads instead of bicons. Then I'm taking four more and I'm going through the following. And again, four going to the following and I'm going to continue this until the end of this row and when I'm up to here I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next okay guys and now I'm here at my last bicon and I'm going through this C bit and this is what I have you see here is where my angle is and here I want to add my ear wire and in order to add it I will do additional step I'm going through this bicon and I will go through these two seed beads here I will add only one seed bead go again through these two 
and I will attach my ear wire at this additional C bit that I added. This angle bit here at the top. Okay. I want to reach it again. And I'm going through it. And what I want to do is take my ear wire and I will take one C bit, go through my ear wire, and I'm going to take one more C bit, you see, and I will go through this angle bit that I just added, and I'm going to pull. Then I will go three times around this joint here. Okay. Now after I reinforced my work, I will make some knots and cut my thread. Okay, in order to make my knots, I will go here, let's say, at the angle. And I will go once. Then I will go second time through the loop I've made. And I'm going to pull. And then I will go through my following seed bit and I might want to repeat uh, the knots and when I'm ready I will cut my thread and my earring will be ready. Okay guys and now my earrings are ready. So if you like them and you want to see more and more videos like this, it's a good idea to subscribe if you still haven't and hit that bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh bidding ideas. And if you want to support me you could also like, share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action and I'll answer to all of your questions down there in the comments. If you make beautiful jewelry following my tutorials please share them on my facebook page that i posted below you could also check my new merch store where you could find t-shirts pillows hoodies max phone covers and so many other stuff and the designs are made especially from me for you when you buy stuff from them there you support me my channel and my mission and uh, you could find links down there in description and here at the eye icon thank you so much for watching bye bye from me